Good afternoon from the CBS 19 newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. And I'm Justin Early. Tyler police say 20 year old Joaquin Goldstein turned himself in today in the death of Brianna Young. Investigators believe Goldstein was in one of the cars on Mockingbird that exchanged gunfire at Pete C. Cole Park July 30th, killing that young mother. More suspects could be named. OSHA and the Gray County Fire Marshal's Office are investigating after three East Texas men were injured in an oil field explosion in Gray County. It happened right before 1 p.m. Saturday at 1010 Cox Dairy Road. The latest on the investigation and how the victims are doing tonight. Funeral services are set for a Dallas area mother and daughter allegedly shot by a Tyler native. Irby Bowser is accused of killing Toya Smith and her daughter Tasmia Allen along with two other people. Funeral services for Allen and Smith will happen Saturday. Bowser is also accused of shooting and injuring four other people. Bowser graduated from Robert E. Lee High School. His bond is set at $6.5 million. Are you confused about the Affordable Health Care Act? You're not alone. A meeting in East Texas today aimed to clear up some misconceptions about the program that many people know as Obamacare. We'll show you what those are and what changes the Health Care Act will really bring tonight. And Mineola transforms into a movie lot. A production company is shooting a movie about Bigfoot there over the next few weeks. How East Texans are getting involved tonight. Where is Bigfoot? Where that is, is the he? question. Mm. Join us for all that plus weather and sports tonight on KYTX, CBS 19 News at 5 and 6, and the latest anytime at CBS19.tv. See you tonight.